Botox Tristan. Today we're going to run through Perfectil Platinum by Vitabiotics, an A to Z vitamin with extras in it aimed at maintaining skin radiance. Let's have a look at some of the ingredients. Let's answer the question you really want to know, will it work? Well, it contains biomarine collagen. There's been no substantiation with the EC with regards to any health claim and I had a look through trial data with regards to improving maintenance of the skin. It also contains grapeseed extract and pine bark extract. They contain something called proanthrocyanidins. What do these chemicals do? Well, it's been shown in wound studies that healing time can be improved when taking them. However, the trials need greater work and the EC hasn't established this as a health claim. It contains green tea extract. Now green tea is very popular. It contains polyphenol. Polyphenol is supposedly a very strong antioxidant. What does this mean? It means that the chemicals that are produced by the body that could potentially be harmful in this case to the skin and cause breakdown and potentially produce wrinkles would be reduced dramatically by taking green tea extract. Unfortunately, more trials are required to substantiate this and again it's another one where the EC won't accept this as a health claim. Lycopene extract is also included in Perfectil Platinum. Lycopene extract has many skin claims against it but none have been authorised. One of the potential mechanisms which a company at the moment is trying to authorise with the EC is that it opens up the capillaries under the skin in the dermis. This allows nutrients into the skin and waste chemicals to be removed which could improve the texture and radiance of the skin but it's not been substantiated at this moment in time as of March 2015. Black currant seed oil is also included in Perfecto Platinum. Black currant seed oil contains omega-6. Now omega-6, one of the claims which hasn't been substantiated is that it improves skin moisture. Omega-6 of course contained in many nuts for example. What has been shown in one trial in infants is that there's a reduction in eczema when there is supplementation but further work will be required to substantiate that angle too. Then we've got alpha lipoic acid included in there as well. Now there's patchy data on this, there's some data on skin lightening effects, there's some data with regards to preventing damage from UV, but it requires further work, further trials to substantiate this. Coenzyme Q10 is also included in Perfecto Platinum, but again there's a general lack of data with regards to skin and none of the claims can be established against coenzyme Q10. Let's have a look at some of the control trials now with a combination of these products. So for example there's been a small clinical trial with lycopene, collagen, vitamins and a fish oil on top and what's been found is that there was a reduction in wrinkle depth in that small trial. Let's look at Perfecto Platinum itself and this is reasonably exciting. 80 women were tested last year they were all between 35 and 55 years of age. They took two tablets once a day, which is the recommended dose of Perfecto Platinum. They were tested before four months of taking the tablet and then six weeks after stopping taking the tablet. 40 of them were given Perfecto Platinum. 40 of them were given blank tablets containing nothing. What was found after four months was that there was a reduction in skin thickness in the blank tablet arm. In the active arm, the ones who were taking Perfectil, it was found that the skin thickness was maintained. But there was a questionnaire and patients in the two groups were unable to differentiate between wrinkles and skin radiance. But what could be said from the trials is that skin thickness could have an effect on wrinkles in the long term and that over many winters may have a cumulative effect, although this would need to be established.